girls here and we're on our next adventure so as you can see the sun is really nice and bright which is fantastic I'm taking you to a new location this morning um, and I've got a special friend with me I'm going to introduce her to you a bit later but as you can see I've got my little pumpkin in the back say hello Ari busy on our iPad keep tuned there are a number of small car parks dotted along the bay most which are free but please double check the signage just to make sure we parked outside the Botany Bay restaurant please check them out they have good food and hospitality is also great in the summertime parking is definitely at premium so allow a lot of time to find parking. While walking along the coast, we looked for pushchair, wheelchair access, but we couldn't see any. So please do your research beforehand. You don't want to miss out. Hey guys, I'm so excited um, today. Can you see who I am in this beautiful talk structure? Where am I? Ebony Outdoors is in Botany Bay in Margate. Excited, it's really windy. So I'm just in this cave to kind of shut out some of the wind. But yes, I'm here here today and I have a special friend with me today. So I'm gonna jump down. Cause you know me, I like to climb. Jumping down and in this next hole, who do we have? Ta -da! Guys, this is Susan. M. So Susan is the winner of our paddleboard competition. Come Susan, come out. <laughs> Susan likes Hello. that area. Everyone. Welcome to Ebony Outdoors. Thank, thank you for you, coming. Thank you for inviting me. So I've known Susan for many, many years. And yes, we are both Susan and we are both mad in nature. So I've said, <laughs> hey, she's laughing. So I said, I want to do something um, a bit different today. And I ran an idea past Susan and she said, yes, I want to be here. So today, as I said, we're in Botany Bay. Um, it is really windy and it's cold because we're in January. So today we're just going to take you down the coastline and just to see what's along here. There's some wind farms, there's some container ships out in the sea at the moment. And a bit later on, the aim is to get a bit wet. Mm. We're going to be a bit wet. Wow. So, <laughs> something to look forward to. Definitely something to look forward to. So, what we're going to aim to do is go into the sea <laughs> and get a bit wet. So, um, I hope you enjoy it with us today. Ebony Outdoors. There are a number of activities that can be done on the beach, all dependent on the weather. On a cold January day, we built sandcastles, the children went shell and rock collecting. You can fly kites. Look for sea creatures pulled in by the tide and take long, long scenic routes along the coastline. Let's hear from Susan why Botany Bay is so therapeutic. Okay, so as we um, walk along the coastline, Susan, you say that this is a family friendly beach? Oh yes, we've done a bit of a risk assessment around here. Uh, I would say it caters for all members of the family. It's quite a flat terrain, so older folks, younger folks, they would enjoy walking along here without any stress. And there are little concaves around so you could stop and rest a while. It's beautiful, you could have me time here if it's just you just walk for nature, to enjoy nature. Or you could go with a family to share in this beautiful setting, spread your mat and enjoy yourself. Walking dogs, some baby families there. It appeals to all ages. I think so. Bring, yeah. so. bring your family and come along. Have some time away from the big cities, from away from the, the hustle and bustle. And bustle. Yeah. Just come and enjoy nature. Beautiful scenery, just quiet, tranquil. No scary noises. You don't hear any sound of traffic, even. It's just beautiful. Awesome. Make it a date. I think she's trying to take over my show. Oh, yeah, can't wait. <laughs> it's just the name. Susan. Because Susan Shows. and I were earlier on, we were climbing some of the chalk structures. So we're going to do a bit of a twirl so you can see the back of us. Let's twirl, Susan. White chalk all the way down. Chalk. It's real chalk. It's real chalk. So we're just. Not imitation. Through. No, no imitation. It's not plastic. 
We've tested it. We've tested it. Sean's on the shirt. Right. So if you just, if you can span up, you can see how high the, the rocks, the chalk formation actually is. Yeah. And you could see it lines. Yeah. Like many levels over the years of and erosion. And can you see all the people who subscribe, not subscribe, <laughs> inscribed, what's the word? They sort of carved their names. Carved. Yeah. They carved their names into the talk structure. Engraved. Engraved, that's the word. So they've engraved. So can we see some of the engraving? Oh, Ethan. Ethan was here. I'm sure it's Shaba. Shaba, B and Q. Dan was here. Archer King. Archer King. A, whatever that is, <laughs> something. Botany Bay is located in the southeast of England. It boasts luscious, long, pretty coastlines. During the winter, the sea temperature can drop to as low as six degrees. And believe me, when we were in there, it was colder than six degrees. During the summer, the sand is yellow and fluffy but in the winter, it's more brown because it's always wet. Botany Bay is a good place to go swimming. So we're going out there. Oh, my eyes are wet. Eyes are crying. You're gonna cry now. Right, so. I to do the whole bay watch running into the water, but clearly that's not gonna happen.
Come on, girl. You can do it. As this is my first cold water swim dunk dip, I would suggest that if you're going to do the same, wear a wetsuit. It helps keep off the wind chills. What I found when in the water, that my breathing became shallow, and this is called cold water shock. If this is your first time going into cold water, please don't go by yourself. Take someone with you. Although the water looked calm on the surface, don't underestimate the power of the undercurrent. All in all, it was a great day, but it was a cold day. So why not check out 
Botany Bay in Broadstairs. <laughs>